So we are here. Now I just need to remember how to bloody play this game. Oh yes, I remember now. Long live the king. Yes, yes, the king. So I need to do things and stuff. One of those things and stuff is continuing our quest that we were doing last time. So let's see here. Uh, da, da, da. Let's see here. According to here, I expect you to consider goblins to be abomination. Is horrified that here if is considered to use beasts as soldiers. Blah blah blah. And they will attack Mornhold. I am here to kill the goblin war chiefs and report back. Apparently, don't know where they're trained. In addition, the two goblin war chiefs mentioned are at least two Alpmir in charge of training the goblins. If I get rid of them, the go the goddess will also be pleased. All right. So it looks like I need to ask people about goblins. Right, as I'm good at, I can talk to people. Hello, how you doing? Do you know anything about like goblins? King's health to you, Sarah. Well, thank you. A good king's health to you too, Mr. Man. All right. Uh, oh God, no, 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 brandish sword. Uh, let's talk to you, goblins. Do you know anything about them? I don't even like to think about the vile beasts. Right, fair enough. I agree with what you gotta say. However, I'm going to do a nice, lovely, quick save, and I'm going to. Well, we're gonna have a nice, lovely conversation, me and you, Mr. Triangle Chin. Oh no, no, not with the sword, though, with my tongue. Right, so, let's admire you. Why, why did I say you have mighty fine vacant eyes? Oh, yes, you have massive not-so-great lips. Uh, yes, your nose is rather rambunctious. Now, what do you know about these goblins? The old vermin, I'd love to get my hands on one of those scrawny little necks. The people are making a stink about seeing around the city recently, especially in Godreach area. I'll keep my eyes out for them. Godreach, where's that? Godreach is on the western side of the city. There are a number of manors there, owned by some of the more wealthy citizens. You also find the Craftsman Hall, which is a fine place to find armor and weapons. They'll even make them all to order, provided that you have the materials. You can check out the Ringed Glad Tavern as well. Not a bad place for a drink if you need the place to stay for the night. You might check out the Art Museum of Artifacts as well. Kira is already trying to add things to his collection. So they are over there. Right, thank you, Big Lips. Right, we're going to go over there and hopefully might find something more about the goblin people. The goblin people might be nice. And also, I don't know if I said hello to Coda Jet. If so, well, I'm glad I have. If not, hello! Hopefully you're doing well. It's been a while since I've seen you, but hopefully things are all fine and dandy for you. So let's go into here. Oh. It's locked from the inside! Oh, I guess he's locked himself in. Perhaps he's having a bit of a mental breakdown. Can't blame him, being a king is tough. Now do you need to remember how to get out of this place? Hello, oh, world guard! City of Justice. Justice. Brother, city of yes, justice demands retribution. I know, I know. Right, okay, so where is west? West is this way. That is a wall. Okay, west is not that way. Let's go north, then west. That sounds like the best solution. A P U A Argonian. I don't know what you mean by that acronym. P U A. I don't know. I can tell you I am an Argonian. A very fancy Argonian, as you can see right here. What is that noise? It keeps fading in and out. A pickup artist. Well, yes, I like to think I am a rather uh, pickup artist, that is, if anyone can actually tolerate me. But that's just that. Some people absolutely More hate me. City of Light. City of magic. Yeah, a lot of people are actually telling me that. Anyway, so, hello, uh, all the trees and plants, little lawns and paths are hymns to the praise of Mexi's name. It's humble work, Sarah, but I'm very proud of it. Do you know anything about goblins? Goblins and more, I've heard odd stories about the creatures beneath the sewers of Godreach, but I never thought goblins. Terrible creatures. Oh, so God's Reef, and then I need to go to the sewers. Great. Just where I've always wanted a bloody go. More sewers. But yes, I am an Argonian pickup artist. After all, you know, I'm so fancy looking. I mean, look at my frilly ears and my shiny shield. I mean, don't you think if you saw this walking down the street, it gave you a few compliments and, you know, obviously I would, you know, personally drop my knickers, but that's just me, you know? Personally, I'm a sucker for frilly ears. Frilly ears are amazing, but that's just me. Yay, more sewers, said no one ever. But basically, uh, I think we just came from the sewers, and we just had to go into them, so that's the Great Bazaar, that's to the south. Now that I'm about, I think we came from the west, didn't we? Maybe we did, maybe we didn't. Maybe this will lead me to the west. That's the palace courtyard. So yes, this is the wrong place. Maybe I should go to the Great Bazaar, maybe. That's going towards the east. How about we just go south? Yes, yeah, south on the palace sounds great. Yes, because I think I just did a huge circle, didn't I? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. And I don't mind me, I was just here. I'm just going to jump my way through. There we go. Right, so. 
Who was saying that? What did you? Justice never sleeps. Yes, justice demands it. That's a naked man. Hello, naked man. How can I help you? Uh, Force down the sweltering. See something or move on. What are you looking at? No, I'm not paralyzed, and I've never met a witch, much less been asked to escort one anywhere. Why am I naked? Because it's too damn hot here. You think that every time you see a naked North barbarian, he's been tricked by some witch. So narrow-minded now. Leave me alone. All right, fine enough. You've been, you know, persuaded by a witch. For those kids watching at home, never be a pickup artist. You might be stabbed, and you deserve it. Maybe. That's a good point. I mean, you know, just randomly going around, flicking your ears at people, you know, that may, in fact, get your ears chopped off. So now I need to find some way to enter the sewers here. Yep, totally tripped by a witch, you know that. Perhaps he was a pickup artist. Perhaps. Perhaps. Now where, oh, where is the sewers? Let's go into water. Hello, Mr. Sewers. Respond back if you are Riv here. Yeah, you get stabbed with a fork. Go to Jet is right. All three Pongs. Pongs? Oh, God. I'm gonna get stabbed by Pong. Not my cat, but the general, like, general stick that bounces balls between each other in a 2D realm. It'd be a Pong fork, a 2D fork. Could you imagine being stabbed with a 2D fork? How brittle would that be? Incredibly so, but probably very painful at the same time. Right, so let's go down into the residential sewers. Hello, you look like an Alvmir. You look rather suspicious just standing there. Is limited. Yeah, mine is too. Oh, you're magical. Oh dear. She's magical. You know what that means? She's dangerous and probably wants to murder me. Right, so hello, murderers. Can't talk now, Argonian. I'm waiting for someone. Oh, I see how it is. You thought Argonians could breathe underwater. Well, you see, in they can. However... They get an innate spell. Let me try and find it quickly. Let's see it. Water breathing. That basically they can breathe underwater for two minutes whenever I want. She's a witch. Well, we're scared of witches. She might take all my clothes. And we all know that I spent a long time gathering my clothes. Anyway, down into the residential sewers. To try and find some goblins. Ooh, this place looks eerie. Very eerie. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna save right here because I feel like I might get ambushed by goblins any moment. But mind you, they are goblins, and goblins are goblins after all. I won't bother looting those chests. I'm just here hunting rabbits. I mean, goblins. Hello? Goblins! Where art thou? Oh. You look like a goblin. Hello. Do you not stop, you know, swaying back and forth? Honestly, it looks like he's doing a funky dance routine. I actually rather like him. I know, I don't understand why these sewers are always so large in video games. They are a truly weird thing, to say in the least. I mean, yeah, you could perhaps have a giant city in here. You would think it'd be like a narrow cave. You would think so. But I would also think this is a goblin gonna die to a butt stab. Okay, butt stab didn't work too well. Stop healing yourself. No, bad goblin. Okay, the goblin knows how to heal. Goblin knows how to hurt. Ow. Wow, okay. Goblins hurt a lot. I'm glad I saved. I really am. All right, goblins are no pushover, especially to the good old Mr. Fibbles. Bloody hell, they're even more deadly than um the Brotherhood Assassins. They really are. Well, so I think am I meant to kill all these things? I actually don't know. Kill the goblin war chief. Oh god, I have to kill the people who are leading them. Well. I guess you gotta start somewhere, you know? And it turns out our somewhere is in fact stabbing everyone brutally. Now, the real question is, is can I just piss one of them off, like you? Well, I pissed one of them off. That's it, come over here, come over here, Mr. Goblin. That's it, hopper, boppity, and bop. You know, I don't care what you're wielding. It is incredibly dangerous and I don't like it. At all. Please die. Please die quicker. Thank you. What on earth were you hitting me with? You were hitting me with a goblin sword. That goblin sword is almost as good as my daedric katana. A katana made by the gods themselves, basically. Is it light? Oh my god, that is one good thing. 
Not as good as my golf as my glass shield, though. More window of an Undertale mod where you can make friends. Oh god, that sounds like a terrific time indeed. Alright, so shall we take this? I mean, I don't know. I mean, it is rather a balanced sword. I mean, it's just slightly worse than my Jadu Katana, and I can even thrust with it quite well. Oh, that's why I didn't kill him. I thrusted with it. Alright, no thrusting. Slashy and choppy, no thrust. Alright, okay. Also, I should be bloody careful because these goblins hurt. Also, Mr. Goblin, I need you to turn round, please. Please move. Mr. Goblin, please move. No, you're not going to move? Then very well. I'm going to move with you. You don't seem too happy. Well, let me end this happiness for you. Well, that's rather simple. I mean, I'm sorry, sorry, that you can't die just like that. Holy crap, that does a lot of damage. Goblin weaponry is no joke. I would have thought, oh, it's just, you know, a goblin, you know? Oh, they're not going to do too much. You know, it's just a goblin, you know? What was the worst they could do to savages? Turns out, no. Goblins aren't savages. Not in the slightest. Goblins are goblins. Goblins are evil. Goblins want to murder me. In a not-so-polite way. Can you stop humping your friend? I want to try to get one of you alone so I can stab you. Please. Please, let me stab you. Okay, thank you. Do you want to stab your friend, or... No? Okay, good. Alright, let's go to you. No, no thrusting. I want to slice you. Oh, God. You're not angering your friend, are you? No, you're not... Oh, God, your friend's been angered. Look, friend. Nothing happened. I don't exist. Oh, what's that? Your friend just had a violent spasm and died? Oh, such a shame, isn't it? No, no thrusting. Whoa, that was a nice attack. At least have one time together before you murder him. Well, I did. I let them have their time together and he wandered off. He shouldn't have wandered off. He should have just stayed with his nice, lovely fella. Or lady, in fact. I can't tell the genders of these people. But how do I need to do it? If not, we're all going to have that one last moment with me. With a giant, almost good, godlike swords. Honestly, like, why are goblins, like, so amazing in this game? In every other game, it's just like, oh, there's a goblin. Also, there's a few people over there. Naked people? Okay, there's naked people over there. I'm vaguely scared. Let's just clear out the area quick before we go talk to the naked people. Naked people tend to not be good people. Just saying. Whenever naked people come about, they normally are incredibly powerful. That or some type of god in disguise. Now you, you just seem to be straying back and forth with a nice tune in your face. How did you not see me? I was right in your face! Apparently, you know, he just doesn't care. I'm taking that endurance potion. Drain intellect, but hey! Endurance? What the hell was that? What the on earth are you? I'm scared. I'm not going that direction. That scares me. Right, so what I want to do, without angering people, is going back to our entrance over here. Maybe they don't aggro? Well, they definitely did aggro, but I should have stabbed the man first. Well, the goblins are going to want to kill me, aren't they? I mean, typically everything that isn't human wants to murder me. I mean, it'd be a rare circumstance if they don't. I am certainly a monster indeed, though. Wanting to murder things before they murder me. I'm starting to have to kill them. It's my job. I was paid to do it. If I want to progress the game, I have to murder people. Sadly, but hey, I'm not saying I'm enjoying it too much. I'm a bit scared of this still raid right here. So I'm gonna. Someone watching me. I can tell. No one's watching you. Don't worry. No one at all is watching. By any chance, are you guys prisoners, or are you just holding this man hostage? You're wearing funky armor. Hello. Welcome to my world, where we do things my way. Oh, what is your way? Tell me about it. What do you want? Okay, never mind. Hello! I let the boss do all the talking. Talk to him? Okay, hi boss. No, he doesn't care. Okay, Talk hello! To the boss. Help me! Help me! Okay, goodbye. You don't want to talk to me? Okay, when well, a boss doesn't want to say anything to me, well, it's a good day to you, Mr. Boss. Um, I hope you're having a friend of your... Do all the talking. Yeah, okay, talk to the boss. He doesn't care about me, I'm afraid. Well, leave that naked man alone. He seems to be having a fun time with him anyway. 
I think they are just running a some sort of uh, hostage situation, so to say. Well, it's not my way to get in the way of that situation. I mean, if that's how they want to make money and make friends with people, I mean, go ahead, make friends that way. Now I'm going to have to deal with these monsters down here. I have no idea what these creatures are. And to be honest, they scare me. They actually scare me slightly, because I don't know what they are. They could be incredibly powerful monsters. They look like dinosaur alligator things. Just look at that tail wiggle. You don't like me, do you? What are you? A diseased Kozok. Oh, you're dead? Do you have anything good on you? You have meat. I'd rather not eat diseased meat, thank you very much. And then there's you. And poke. Ha ha! So not too hardy, at least. Now, where, oh, where are these goblins? Oh, I kind of angered you, didn't I? I'm sorry. Maybe we can still be friends. I don't think we can be friends. I'm sorry. Look, I just wanted to make friends with your goblin people. I am immune to disease, but you never know. I might... think it's just you've got to think about the taste. Right? You need to think about the taste of diseased meat. Diseased meat is not going to taste too nice. I mean, let's be honest about that, right? Hello, goblins! No, no goblins there. I have no idea where I'm going. I just want to say that. This is adds flavor and extra vitamins. But that may be true. Hello, Mr. Goblin. There's a lot of you down here, isn't there? Oh, I'm sorry I angered you. All right, Mr. Hoppity Goblin, I need you to die. You are painful. I don't like you. That is a lot of pain you're giving me. I need you to stop blocking everything I'm doing. It's rude and uncouth. Okay, you're drinking potions. If you're drinking potions, I'm drinking potions. But it's not fair. Where's my good potions? There they are. All right. I'm drinking this. Now you leave me alone. Leave me alone, Goblin Man. There we go. Now, that wasn't nice of you to drink potions. What do you have? You have steel. Bloody hell. Who are cripping these goblins? What are their stuff made out of? That's something I'm interested in. Hello, what's over here? Seems to be a broken door of some kind. Hello, Mr. Broken Door. There seems to be some type of cave-in. Carved out slightly. No. Oh. Now, what's behind here? Is it more pesky goblins? Huh? Any goblins want a nice, lovely hug? Handshake? Maybe a stab or two? No, there's just more water. Water, where'd you go? Tell me that you're Riverman ways. This is a door. Okay, door. The bazaar is yours. I haven't finished exploring this bit, so let's finish exploring this bit. Then I go to the bazaar. Right. So, where are the rest of his goblin-like friends? I don't see any. Hello? This is a bit suspicious, I'm not gonna lie. A giant open hall like this. Seems to be an intersection of some kind. Where does this go? Does this go to the bazaar? That goes to the bazaar. Alright, alright. Ow! You're a skeleton and a mud crow. Oh, no, that's a rat. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. How you doing? I don't even know what type of skeleton you are. But all I know is you've got silver. Right, I want to fight one of you at a time, please. Can you be nice? Please be nice. Right, one of you are down. I need you to go down, please. You actually hurt quite a bit. It's not nice. Please stop hurting me. Also, give me one second. So, but I just had to move my monitor slightly. So, skeleton champions. So, necromancers down here too. Let's take a nap. Since that rat hasn't aggroed on me yet, that isn't classed as an enemy. For some strange unknown reason. Hello? Door? What's this? The Royal Palace of Basements. As much as I'd love to go in some random man's basement in the Royal Palace, I'd rather do a bit more exploring. Because it was sunk all the way up this ramp. I just need to follow the goblin trail, basically. That's something what I need to do. And there's one right there. So I'm going the right way if I just follow the goblins. That's a lot of bloody goblins. Excuse me, Mr. Goblin. Just don't... Turn! Don't worry, friend. He's just taking a nap. You see, in goblin time, it's like 15th lunch. 
at... I can't tell the time because I'm more worried about people. Foot soldier? You're different. You certainly are. Okay, you need to stop it. 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 Okay, you need to stop healing. Stop healing. Bad. What are you? You look scary. You hurt. Oh, God. Please stop hurting. Okay, I need to go this direction. Please stop hurting me. You fiend. Come down here. Come on. Oh, you're trying to flank me, are you? Well, I'm going to kill your pet. How about that? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Please, no. Please, no. I'm going to presume the man with the claw happens to be the war leader. Okay, down I go. Ow, that hurt. Please, never drinking potion of wonder. Where are you? That's bargain. Uh, da, 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 da. Where is a good healing potion? Quality! There we go. Drinky, drinky, and down we go and swim away. Dear God, who said you could have a bloody claw? Okay, can you please leave me alone? Please leave me alone. My God, that hurts. A lot, and I'm drowning. Well, okay, so turns out that might be their war leader right there. Turns out he has a giant claw the size of his face. Turns out he wants my face to add onto his collection of faces. Turns out he's a face collector. Right, so now I know where that goes. I can't an enemy that direction, but there's not an enemy, enemy this direction. How on earth do I deal with the giant evil man with the claw? And I don't mean the guy from Inspector Gadget, either. Sad I could never be Inspector Gadget. I don't have an amazing uh, arsenal of items coming out of my body. I could use my body and lure them towards me. I could. That's a good point. I could shiver them in the face. But no, no, that's just mean. We don't want to be mean. We want to be right and just. So you are Angry Claw Man. If I kill everything that is an Angry Claw Man, Angry Claw Man should leave me alone. Quote, unquote. Okay, he won't leave me alone per se, but he will most definitely just be like, Oh, hey, you killed everyone. I'm just going to not really care much, and I'm going to fall over dead like everyone else. Time to die, Dezog. I said time to die, Dezog. Please die. Die quicker. Please die. Please die before your friends notice. Right, he died before his friends noticed. Thank you. Thank you very much for that. Now let's go... Oh, you're... Oh, God, he's going his way. You're not seeing anything. I'm just uh, a petal flying around. You don't notice anything. Yes, nothing. Nothing at all. Including the dagger in your back. Okay, no one noticed the giant battle between him. As far as they're concerned, he was just having a spasm like their war leader right now was having. Yes, yes, yes. I'm really scared of a bloody war leader. I really am. He does too much damage for his own sake. That's right, you keep on just walking. Walk in, go on. Go along. Come on. I believe in you. I believe in your powers. Just go away. That would be great. Good job. You know how to go away. Let's wait a bit. You can stand there for a little bit, aren't you? Oh, you're moving away from him. That's convenient, isn't it? Oh, God. Hi, you see nothing. Don't worry. Uh, I'm just going to bink you. Sorry, I had to bink you. That's just the way of the trade. Now, is there a way I can take off your claw? Okay. I'm just going to go this direction. I might actually turn that corner and save. Saving sounds good. It sounds very good. Something I actually rather like. Yes, yeah, so you continue going down and investigate while your friend's sleeping. He's just lazy. Yes, lazy, not dead. Right. I saved. It's just me and you, Mr. Claw Man. You and your pesty claw will be the end of this world. I say that now.
Oh, he's a bruiser, not a war chief. So close to death! God damn you, magic pixel! That's enough. Did work now. Did work. Yes, save often and don't die. The don't die part is the most important part. Actually, the saving part is actually the most important part. You can die as much as you want, as long as you, you know, relive Groundhog Day. Right, this time, I need to be not be stubborn and use a potion. When he uses a potion. The reason why is because he cheats. And no one likes a cheater. Especially a goblin cheater. Because goblin cheaters are not the nicest of cheaters. No, not stabbing. There we go. And good night, my bruiser. Oh. We can't be stun locked. There we go. The stun lock bruiser's dead. And I don't even get his bloody claw. That's annoying. I want his claw. Apparently, the game says no. I can't have his claw. His claw's illegal. Bloody claw hating game. Like, could you imagine me, Mr. Fibbles, with claws instead of his dainty gloves? Could you imagine it? Of course you can. And I can imagine it too. It'd be a beautiful time. A beautiful time indeed. Now, I don't think I actually have any hammers. Let's see if I do have any repairing hammers. I don't think I bought any, did I? No, I did not. Okay, never mind. So this goes to the West Sewers. Apparently, to the West Sewers we go. Because apparently there's a lot of goblins by this gate. Now, the real question is... Yeah, there's more goblins. Just follow the trail of goblins. And eventually, oh, eventually, I'll get to where I want to go. As long as it's not enough for Bruiser, I'm perfectly fine. You're a foot soldier, that's fine. I can just keep stabbing you. Just keep stabbing you like nothing ever happened. There we go. You drank your potion. I hate you. Why can't I have your bloody potions? I'll, I'd love to heal too. Can you be considerate about someone who hasn't died yet? Like someone who will live and tell your tale. I will kind of forget about you in a few minutes, but you know, you can at least think about me. But no, he doesn't care what the person that might is going to kill him right away. Nope. You drank your potion too, didn't you? You have skooma. Dude, I'm having that skooma. That's my drugs. In fact... Where is it? That free skooma? I think I might give myself a bit of a treat. Yeah, there we go. Have some nice, lovely meth. Hello, what's going on here? More goblins and... I don't know what you are. That's a bruiser. I can tell that because he doesn't have anything in his hand. Let's see here. And bink, bink, bink. There we go. You drank a potion, did you? Yes, of course you did. Because you're not a nice creature. You're a bruiser. Or are you? What are you? You're an officer. Oh. You're even fancier than a... Watch. You're not a bruiser, so to say. You're just a regular old smo, so come here, smo. No, 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 no stabbing. Slashing. There we go. You didn't drink a potion. Aha! I have your potion now. It's all mine. You have a mug. You have a ladle. You have a jug. You have a skull and a few bones. Well, that sounds like a great time and all. But, you know, they at least could have left something in the mug for me. Could have. Could have been a bit considerate in that regard. But either way, you know who hasn't been considerate in that regard? This bloody officer. You know why? Because he, or she, has giant massive horns, big brutes, that doesn't think about me. Holy crap, you have a lot of health. I need you to stop it. I need you to stop doing what you're doing. Please. You also are a magic caster, apparently. Who hurts a lot. But hey, you're being stunned up by me. The rapid hitting of Mr. Fibbles. Yes, and just like that, you're dead. Ha <laughs> ha! More drugs! I don't know why, but every game I've been playing lately has just got so much drugs. It's ridiculous.